Dear Tesla car enthusiasts, picture yourself among the select few in the know about the forthcoming, game-changing update set to transform Tesla's cutting-edge secret vehicle. Brace yourself, because this isn't just any ordinary car. It holds the promise to potentially catapult your financial standing. The Cybervan seems poised to join Tesla's newest lineup, boasting an astounding range of up to 400 miles coupled with an enticing affordable price tag of 40,000 US dollars. This project stands as Tesla's most ambitious undertaking yet, heralding a breakthrough that's poised to revolutionize the commercial industry. But what exactly does the Cybervan have in store for you? Let's find out in today's episode. Before we begin, please show your support by subscribing and ringing the bell so you won't miss out on any of our interesting videos in the future. Without further ado, let's get started. What will it take for the Cybervan to compete with other models? Based on available evidence, the Cybervan is set to be constructed using the chassis structure of the Cybertruck. This strategic choice is expected to maintain reasonable production costs for the Cybervan, keeping its market retail price within the range of forty to $60,000. Should the Cybervan adopt a truck-like design for transportation purposes, this price bracket would position it favorably against existing competition. Moreover, design features have been integrated to facilitate its effortless conversion into a camper van, a concept enthusiastically embraced by followers who value the practicality of a compact truck. The Cybervan's shell is crafted based on the Cybertruck, utilizing stainless steel metal. It's assumed that Tesla will employ a silver-white metal plate akin to that of the Cybertruck. This eliminates the paint option, reducing production costs, and streamlining the production line by minimizing unnecessary complexity. Additionally, aerodynamics have always been a key factor in bolstering Tesla's range and travel performance. A prime example is the Tesla Semi, a heavy-duty truck boasting a drag coefficient of just 0.22 CD, an impressive figure unveiled by Tesla's designer. Anticipated to follow suit, the Cybervan is expected to feature an angular design rather than traditional curves. Presently, Ford's 2023 e-transit delivery truck starts at around $52,000, while GM's Bright Drop Zevo 600, utilized by delivery services like FedEx, commences at a starting price of $85,000. Tesla has provided valuable insights through a series of clues. A pivotal clue, surfaced during Tesla's Investor Day presentation, showcasing forecasts for the company's entire global electric vehicle fleet. Notably, the Cybertruck is depicted alongside an obscured vehicle resembling a van behind a digital panel, alongside a smaller electric vehicle segment compared to Tesla's previous models. This strongly hints at the ongoing development of the Cybervan. In a market where competitors offer vehicles with estimated ranges spanning from 200 to 250 miles, Tesla might target an exceeding range of 250 miles. This range adequately caters to the needs of many, particularly for commercial vehicles operating within townships, facilitating tasks such as grocery pickups or package deliveries without necessitating long-distance travel. However, the standard truck market is diverse, accommodating various use cases. While acknowledging that some businesses may demand optimal range, Tesla could potentially leverage an advantage by offering options surpassing the 300-mile mark and potentially even reaching 400 miles for personal use. Nonetheless, an extended range entails a larger battery, and herein lies a potential challenge for Tesla's van amidst the ongoing supply shortage. This shortage might limit innovation and competitive capabilities for Tesla's van due to the need for larger batteries. So then how will Tesla deliver a stunning design that appeals to customers? Musk has progressively shared more explicit details regarding his vision for a van in recent years. In his master plan part de, he coined it as a high-density urban transport vehicle. Moreover, in July of 2022, Musk tweeted about the concept of a configurable van suitable for both passengers 
and cargo, eliciting enthusiastic responses from his followers. Successive unveilings of Cybervan designs have provided glimpses of a forward-looking aesthetic that harmonizes with the industrial essence of the Cybertruck. Speaking of the Cybertruck, it appears that this model could significantly influence the design philosophy behind the Tesla van. Consequently, what can we anticipate from the Tesla van or the Cyber van based on the existing evidence? Reasonable speculation suggests its potential to accommodate a substantial number of passengers by incorporating rear seat options. Envisioned with a futuristic design that complements the industrial allure of the Cybertruck, a van inspired by this iconic model might preserve the stainless steel exoskeleton that has enraptured numerous enthusiasts. This innovation is significant as conventional vans often exhibit signs of wear, particularly rust formation on exposed frame areas. Hence, the incorporation of a stainless steel frame structure holds promise as a cost reduction factor in cybervan production. Moreover, the sliding door design would bring desirable practicality for camping trips, seamlessly transforming the van into a mobile home. How could this vision become a reality? Taking cues from the GM Brightdrop EV600, renowned for its spaciousness with dimensions of 288 inches in length and 107 inches in height, it's evident that a van of such proportions could offer ample interior space for multifaceted functionalities. Considering Musk's perspective on the Cybervan's size, where he emphasized the need for the Tesla camper to surpass the Model X in size, it's plausible to assume that the Tesla van might measure around 250 inches in length, fitting neatly within Tesla's compact standards. Furthermore, Tesla stands out as one of the most accessible national solar installation providers. Despite numerous solar installation companies available across the country, Tesla remains one of the largest, installing solar panels and unique solar roof installations in all 50 states. Their commitment to competitive pricing compared to solar panel competitors adds weight to the integration of solar panels into the van's roof, offering potential for harnessing renewable energy to power various functions within the vehicle, a truly feasible and eco-friendly option. Additionally, the recent discovery of Starlink technology being incorporated into the Cybertruck, evident from the visible Starlink mobility dish on the Tesla Cybertruck, implies that the satellite internet system can be seamlessly integrated into electric vans. This revelation is particularly intriguing, especially given the design of the high-performance flat Starlink mobility dish, which is intended to be affixed to vehicles and adaptable for any position in the future. This revelation gains prominence as the Cybervan is slated for production in 2026, coinciding with the anticipated stabilization of the Starlink infrastructure. The strides made in Tesla's ecosystem integration truly signify the promise of a dream product, offering comprehensive utilities for users and delivery fleets alike. If initial estimates regarding the Cybertruck's battery size hold true, and if the Tesla van is constructed on the Cybertruck chassis rather than the Model X, the Tesla van could boast a battery pack of up to 200 kilowatt hours, potentially reduced to 100 kilowatt hours for the base model. This substantial boost in battery production comes at a time when the industry grapples with the scarcity of battery raw materials. Equipping the Cybervan with the new CATL M3P battery is poised to revolutionize battery technology and performance. Official data reveals that the M3P battery developed by CATL operates on a new material system with an energy density of 210 watt hours per kilogram, approximately 15% higher than lithium iron phosphate batteries. This innovation has proven to increase the driving range of the Model 3 produced in the Shanghai factory by 10%. Moreover, the cost of the M3P battery is on par with lithium iron phosphate batteries and lower than third tier lithium batteries. Blending the cathode material of the CATL M3P battery with third tier lithium and iron phosphate manganese lithium materials addresses concerns related to short cycle life and high resistance observed in lithium iron phosphate batteries. Interesting. Interestingly, General Motors, a rival of Tesla, produces the Ultium battery utilizing the nickel-cobalt-manganese-aluminum, or NCMA, design to 
meet the power demands akin to the potential Cybervan. However, GM's Ultium battery still incorporates Cobalt, a contributing factor to the challenges faced in current electric vehicle manufacturing costs. Now, what features will set the Cybervan apart from the rest? The Cybervan stands poised to integrate autonomous driving capabilities, a testament to Musk's concentrated efforts toward developing robotaxis and advancing the Cybervan. In early November, Musk announced the impending release of Tesla's full self-driving, or FSD, version 12, projected within a fortnight. Musk's penchant for optimistic timelines has often raised eyebrows, yet indications suggest Tesla is making substantial strides in the deployment process. Musk corroborated the information via Twitter, affirming Tesla's commencement of FSD version 12 deployment among employees. This update is anticipated to remove the beta level from the self-driving feature. Initially rolled out to employees on a smaller scale compared to prior updates, this gradual approach seems rational considering the magnitude of changes in this version. The timing of this internal release synchronizes with two pivotal events for Tesla. The imminent Cybertruck delivery event commands attention offering Tesla a platform to showcase its latest breakthrough. Simultaneously, the highly anticipated holiday update, renowned as the year's premiere update, is on the horizon. Tesla's latest public FSD build version 11.4.7.3 stands a few revisions behind the current production builds. Thus, the advent of version 12 is anticipated to bring beta FSD testers up to speed with Tesla's latest features, including predictive charger availability, expedited hazard light response post incidents, and other enhancements present in updates 2023.32 and 2023.32. In terms of the improvements in FSD, the release notes for FSD version 12 are yet to be unveiled. However, the deployment among employees signals imminent discovery of the enhancements accompanying this substantial release. A noteworthy change in version 12 involves the removal of over 300,000 lines of code that formerly governed FSD functions for vehicle control, now leaning more on the Dojo Neural Network. This transition signifies reduced reliance on hard-coded programming. FSD version 12 marks the first instance where the neural network controls steering, acceleration, and braking beyond its prior role of object object detection and attribute determination. This marks a significant leap in Tesla's FSD technology. Musk describes it as an end-to-end -end AI, employing human-like optical processing methods, signaling Tesla's ambition to mirror human decision-making within its vehicles. Labeled Baby AGI, or Artificial General Intelligence, this new version aims to perceive and comprehend the complexities of the real world, gradually evolving in sophistication. The deployment of FSD version 12 marks a pivotal juncture in Tesla's AI, AI and autonomous vehicle journey. It's not just about technological prowess, but also adapting AI to accommodate the diverse behaviors of humans. With Musk's persistent focus on AI evident in his ambitious projects, Tesla maintains a prominent stance in the electric vehicle market and the broader AI revolution. As we await more detailed information regarding the public release of FSD version 12 and its potential unveiling at the Cybertruck event, it's evident that Tesla edges closer to a future where cars are not just self-driving, but also intelligent and adaptable to the intricacies of real-world technology. Why is the Cybervan a crucial product for Tesla's future? Tesla has broadened its vehicle lineup encompassing two sedans, two SUVs, a pickup, and a sports car. 
While these vehicles span diverse markets, Tesla's overarching objective to hasten the shift towards sustainable energy has prompted the company to engage in all major vehicle categories, including commercial trucks seen from a consumer perspective at a commercial scale. Although the commercial truck sector might seem relatively small, its market scale is undeniably significant. Projections indicate a global increase in the commercial vehicle market from 1.35 trillion in 2022 to 1.71 trillion in 2029. The North American commercial vehicle market, standing at $581 billion in 2022, plays a pivotal role in this projection. A significant portion of this market comprises light commercial vehicles ranging from pickups and trucks to three-wheelers. Notably, trucks dominate the light commercial vehicle market share, which continues to expand over time. Tesla's core mission has perpetually aimed to propel the world towards sustainable energy. In the context of commercial trucks, the company recognizes their pivotal role in expediting the conversion process, evident in Elon Musk's unveiling of the truck. Musk's analysis of the pickup truck industry highlighted the lack of innovations and scarcity of electric pickup trucks. This scarcity presents a unique challenge, identifying a pickup truck that genuinely encapsulates the brand brand's essence. Musk emphasizes the urgent need for something distinct and sustainable in the energy landscape to ensure the existence of a viable pickup. The commercial truck market mirrors the pickup truck market, characterized by limited innovations despite its vast scale. A tangible illustration of this market's potential is Amazon's order for 100,000 delivery trucks from Rivian, placed even before the product's completion. This sector harbors substantial opportunities, a fact well acknowledged by Musk. Recognizing the necessity for a breakthrough, it seems Tesla is poised to introduce a new breed of commercial trucks, likely extending beyond the success of the Cybertruck. While Tesla actively pursues sedans and SUVs, emphasizing luxury models, Rivian appears more inclined towards catering to outdoor adventure lifestyles. Rivian's collaboration with Amazon on delivery trucks augurs well for practical and practical and efficient commercial use, an area where Tesla's focus seems relatively less pronounced currently, potentially due to differing business priorities. Despite this, I am confident in the earning potential of the Model 3, the Model Y, and the Tesla van. However, how Tesla allocates funds and navigates future model releases hinges on battery production scaling. As the Cybervan embarks on its production journey, its tenure remains uncertain. The expectations for this vehicle are vast, given the trajectory of innovation and success established by Tesla's prior endeavors. That's it for today. Thanks for tuning in, and if you enjoyed it, please show your support by liking and subscribing to our channel. You can also turn on notifications so you'll never miss out on any of our amazing videos. We appreciate your feedback and your time, and so we hope to see you again in the next video. Until then, take care and have fun.